Dirty a Dynamite, the explosive one. I'm the man on the sticks. And we're playing Hollow Knight Doodlebug. I have uh, come to the point where I think we're done with Crystal Peak. I, honestly, I, I, I don't know. Should I go in here and collect some, some loot? I'd like to try to go and buy another notch slot, which is which is my, my plan, honestly. So let's see how much cheddar this motherfucker gives me. He should give me some big money, though. He gave me a freaking... He gave me a mask shard. Hell yeah. Is that another one? What is this? Grubstone? Oh my god, he is just showering me with cheddar. This is how you liquidate your assets right here, ladies and gentlemen. I am up to 500, 800 bucks. All right, so that, that pretty much makes my story for me, or that pretty much seals the deal of what we're doing next. We're gonna go to that area to the far right bottom side of the screen. It looks a little far away, and it is. But that is where I can buy more charm slots. Or more, uh, what do you call these things? More notches. So we're gonna go there. I think I have enough charms or uh, badges at this point where I should be eligible to purchase a new one. Because I think it was contingent on how many charms I had or how many badges I had if I could buy another one. But I'm pretty sure I got enough. And with this amount of money, shall buy everything there anyway probably just one <laughs> but that's alright it gives me a chance to walk and get a feel for the game and I remember when these guys were tough you remember those days yeah me either alright where am I at now so I do want to go down from here and uh, this leads me to no I don't want to go that way also, I want to. Now that we got new stuff, like I have not even seen this spell yet. So let's let's see what this spell does. It said hold down and press B. Oh, maybe you have to hold it. No. Wait. Okay. That scared me a little bit. Thought I saw something. What's the spell? This one. This this one. B and down. Okay, I could see the usefulness of that. All right, and we want to keep going down. Where'd you come from? Never hit me. You know who you're hitting? You have any idea who my father is? You'll have your ass. You hear me, buddy? Your ass. You know what? I don't have time for you boys. Sometimes the best defense is a good defense, and that's far too much defense for me to be interested in. All right, so we're continuing on our downward path. Hit those guys for a little extra soul. Don't spit your babies at me. I do want to go down from here. Yeah, this is what Daddy recalls. Yeah, the salacious house. What's going on in here? Oh, shit. Big girls need love, too. 900? Come on, dude. Quick focus. Uh, it will help you focus. So if something you're interested in, you should buy this one. Uh, if you ever learn any spells, you should just have uh, heard it make your spells much stronger. 900 for this. Once you own 18 charms, I will gladly sell this one to you. <laughs> oh yeah, you know I did get another charm too. Let's check out some of the, the new the new charm I got. How many do I have? 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15. What was the new one I got? It was the grub one. Uh, gain soul when taking damage. Huh. That's not bad. Uh, Bill makes it easier to escape from danger. 
the long mail. Hmm. Gain soul when taking damage is pretty strong. So I don't have enough charms yet, then, is what you're selling me. Because I needed 18, and how many did I say I had? I totally forgot. 5, 10, 15. So I need three more. Alright, let's see what you got for sale then, baby. What do you got for dad? I could buy the quick focus. I could buy these two. This one, uh, it seeps blood and will certainly improve your constitution. Alright, we're just gonna buy some of the cheaper ones right now. I know you're like dynamite. That goes against everything you said you normally do. You usually buy the most expensive one. Well, you know what? We're going with the Costanza meta. This is where you do exactly like George Costanza did, where he started doing the opposite of everything he said he was going to do in life, and everything started going better for him. To some extent, that, that, that's right, as long as you don't, like, do the opposite of some of the moral choices that you would normally make. Because... <laughs> Then you just kind of become a sociopath. Unless you're already a sociopath. In which case, you know, please change that shit up. Because that's a problem for everybody. Alright, so we're not going to use those new charms. They're strictly for uh, the purpose of getting the next notch slot. Which I really, really do want. I would like to find an area where I think it's in Green Path. So I think we're going to go to Green Path. There's another area where I can use my dash attack. Um, I don't want to go down now. Wait a minute. I changed my mind. Motherfucker. But we're here now. Yeah. I don't think I want to be here now, though. We're going to go back up. I want to hit up Green Path, because I know there was an area in Green Path where there was the, uh, the lake of water, of the acid water, and I want to traverse that with my newfound power. Look at the speed. You see that? Don't be jealous. Congratulate me on my newfound abilities. I'm sorry, is this supposed to be disconcerting to me? It isn't. This is but a minor annoyance. This is not the way. And while we're out here, we're, we're only uh, facilitating our purchasing power for in the future, you know? We're out here making money while we're walking. That's that's always a good point. I am trying to expedite the trip, though. Believe you me. I don't want to be walking around here either. I want progress to be made. And how do you progress? By finding that unexplored territory and exploiting it for your own needs. Now, have I been here before? Yeah, I've been all the way to the end of here. Okay, so this is not necessary for me to do this again. Uh, can I go up from here? Is that is that doable? I can. Kill you. What was that? I got soul from that? Oh yeah, what happens if I strike one of you fucks with my dream now? Away, away. What does that mean? Where there's a will, there's a... Oh man, you have to like time it. eat when is that what they're thinking yo that's crazy uh what's in here 
Is this baby girl? No, it looks like this is actually the way I wanted to go. I thought that might be that lady. Alright. Oh, oh, we're here. Do you remember this? It's been a while. A couple weeks. Oh my god. Since you've seen me fail in this area. Oh, don't think things are going to change just because it's been a while. Yeah. Absolute banger. Lest you forget. Stay back. Oh, God. Mother. I don't know if that invincibility charm that I'm putting in, the one that increases my... Uh, oh, see, there it is. It's down. Or no, there's the lake is up there. And there's another area over there I was not able to get to. Oh, we're searching it all. We're tying up the loose ends like a motherfucker today. Alright, so we want to go... Continue to go to the left. 100%. And we'll go a couple screens, because that looks like what is expected of us. Yeah, a couple more screens. The dive bombers. I absolutely hate these boys. They die in one hit now. The world is my oyster. Never actually had oysters. I think I've had clams before, but never oyster. And don't even get me started on bearded clams. I eat them some bitches like they're going out of style. I never understand why people would say selling like hotcakes. Like, on what planet are hotcakes selling well? I guess that's what you would, what you kind of mean when you say it, right? Like they're selling like hotcakes. Like honestly, do you know the amount of carbs in a hotcake? You should probably be seven less of them. If you're health conscious out there. I'm not super health conscious, but you know. I do practice like uh, veganism and shit. <laughs> for the majority of the time. I don't know. What do you call a person who eats a vegan like 95% of the time? What do you call that person? Am I just a health conscious fucking normie? I mean, I'm fine with that. If you want to call me a normie, I'm fine. I don't feel like a normie, though. Do I want to go down from here? I don't... I can't really... I mean... It doesn't look like it matters, really. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Alright, cool, whatever. Alright, we're almost to the lake here. And we're gonna see what's at the other side. Finally, finally have the ability to see what's at the other side of this frickin' lake. Let's fucking go. Oh. It's nothing. There's nothing here. There's nothing there. All of that, and there's nothing. Why is this even a thing, then? That was, that was kind of, like, demoralizing, dude. I was really expecting that lake to, to yield some benefit to our, uh, to our progression. Like, you know, I would love a double jump or a mask shard would be great. I only need one more mask shard to level my, uh, HP up a little bit. And, uh, that sounds absolutely smashing. giving levels out like hotcakes so it looks like you don't really get stronger in this game through just like killing enemies it's kind of like that it, you know you can get better like charms and shit but it seems like a lot of the upgrades are just kind of uh like standard universal whereas like you get it and then it's yours Am I going to... Yeah, this is the right way. 
Oh ho, I remember you, big boy. How many hits do you die in now? Two? I'll take it. I think I need to kill a couple more of those boys anyway. Alright, we're still going down here. I believe this area is like spikes and shit, so... Oh my god. I know that this should be an area that I can traverse with... You know I'm not gonna let you get away. Two hits to die? That is unfortunate for you. <laughs> I remember when you used to impede my path. <laughs> they are yielding to my blade. I, I, should, I should hit one of those boys with the dream nail. I think I might do that. All right, and then over here. Now I don't remember why we could not make it. Let's see what this does. Okay, it sends me back to the beginning. <laughs> That's one thing. I jumped. You might not have believed it, but it happened. Jump. Okay, well, you know what? All right, jump. I need to get the right amount of air. And then across, and then jump, 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 fudge. All the way back to the beginning. We're gonna get this. All right, jump, 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 jump. Okay, crisscross and make ya. All right, well, we might be coming back here. Okay, yeah, let's go get some soul real quick. We're coming back. We're coming back. <laughs> Not giving up. Can I? What is this? From moss and leaf, our new life is wrong while it grows the patch. Yeah, 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 shut up. Can I have enemies, please? I just need to rebuild my focus. Enemies? Enemies? Really? So you're just gonna play me like this, huh? This is some sort of sick game to you. I guess we could go for this bench and save ourselves the trouble. I think that is definitely in order at this point. And these boys aren't even going to provide that much soul for us because they die so quickly. There's kind of a... kind of a, a, a negative given to us by the fact that we kill enemies faster. Which I never thought I would say, but it looks like there is a little bit of a a debuff that goes along with you being strong. Essentially, the more I hit fuck, essentially the more I hit enemies, the more soul I build up. But if I kill them super fast, then I can't regain soul. Hmm. But you know what? I think it's, I think honestly, it's a fair trade off in my book. I would much rather kill enemies faster and not get as much soul. All right. All right. All right. And then over again. And then slide. And then over. How are we going to make this work? We made it work. Oh my god, okay. Alright, hold on. We might be able to make that. We made it work. And we're just gonna we're gonna go across. Okay, you can't do it that way. Let's heal up. We're actually gonna have to jump these. No, 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 we're good, we're good. We saved it! 
We saved it. Oh. <laughs> All right. Can we do this, please? We can do it. All right. Just take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. We're going back across. We want to open up the shortcut before we do anything else. That is the most paramount thing. I saw the shortcut up here, so I know it exists. That is not even a question. Don't hit any spikes. Be careful. Just walk and swing your blade. Really? Oh, all right. It's actually safe. All right. Shortcut opened up. We're still alive. Whoo! I got a little, got a little touch and go there for a little while. I didn't know if I was actually gonna do it. But you know what? That'll teach me to doubt myself. When you know what you're capable of, it doesn't matter. What is this? What? Oh, come on, dude. How was I supposed to even know? Can I get that? Oh, man. You know what? Fuck that rock. Shit. <laughs> it's 400 bucks, man. I need that. Motherfucker. All right. But, you know, we got the shortcut open. We're going in there with full soul. Well, not full soul, but the ability to... The opportunity to have full soul. I'm going to gather some up right here, actually. A few... Specs of soul. Um, I am going to go to the bench one more time just to maximize effectivity. Yeah, come out. Give me that. Thank you. All right, we got we got half a bar. That's all we should need, especially with the shortcut already open to us. I couldn't see us needing much more than this. Like, this little platforming section is no freaking joke, man. I guess I probably could have even done this without the, uh, the crystal boost. Are you shitting me? I can't make it back. Ugh, I actually have to do it all over again. That's alright, we're ready. No! Okay, that's fine. That's okay. We're learning. And as we go, we grow stronger. Because you have to be bathed in fire in order to succeed in anything that you do. Motherfucker! Alright, that's alright. We're gonna heal up twice. We're gonna heal up once. That's Malarkey. That is also the Malarkus. That is Malarkey. All right, we're gonna go back. <laughs> we're going back. We're gonna die. We lost 400 goddamn dollars. I panicked. I panicked. It's all gone. Dude, why did they lie to me? I unlocked the shortcut. I was guaranteed a shortcut. <sighs> you know, it's all right, though. It's all right, man. It, like I said, man, this game is basically 2D Dark Souls. So you're going to lose all your money. It's going to happen. It's engineered to do it. The pain of loss... It's it's a uh, it's a part of life. All right, technical difficulties, but we're back and I'm in the same spot with barely any life, and I basically feel like I need to do this. So we're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna make it. We're gonna do it. We're doing it for the fucking. My baby might not be good, but that's all right by me. Yeah, yeah. Fuck it, we're going for it. Let's go, boys. It's either it's either death or success right here, 
right now. Crazy Town, TNT freaking dynamite on the sticks, doing the best he can. Can't go away. This is the part I do not like. Look at that business, man. I pressed the button. All right, man, you know what? It's, it's go or go home. It's go home, I guess. God damn it. All right. Well, you know what? We'll, we'll get it on the next episode because, you know, we're back at the bench anyway. And I have to take a whiz. So, thank you for joining me on another episode of Hollow Knight. Be sure to tune in to Jonas's solo work as well. It is oh, oh, magnifique, an amuse-bouche to tantalize your taste buds and then dig in into our collaborative effort because that's meat and potatoes that makes crazy town crazy town. Until tomorrow, thanks for watching. TNT Dynamite and I'm out.